<laughs> Hi guys, this is Dr. Watson, my cute cat, right? <laughs> I named him Dr. Watson after John Watson from Sherlock, because he kind of looks like uh, Martin Freeman a bit, kind of. His hair, I don't know, kind of reminds me. And he's cute and fluffy and he's so kind, right? Aww. So, and since today is one of the last warm summer days, I thought I'd just make a vlog to not let this day pass by without doing anything. Although I was doing a lot today. I was actually painting the kitchen of my mom's house, white, and then one part yellow. So it was actually a pretty busy day. But I'm enjoying the rest of it now. Ah, stop dance. <laughs> My family lives on the countryside. So I was here, it was a bit boring, to be honest. A bit boring. Because there's not a lot of things that you can do on the countryside. <laughs> but it was okay. I helped my mom a bit with the painting stuff. And uh, yeah. So didn't do much though. One thing that I like about my family having farm is we have loads of vegetables and fruits that we grow ourselves and we have just for food. And it's so healthy because we it's all organic and all self-made and we have some really good stuff. So here we got all the fruits we have right now. There's apples, we have lots of different kinds actually, but these are the ones that are best at the moment. And the raspberries, I love those. I can just, in the morning, I can just go outside and pick some and then eat them with my breakfast. And then here we have some plums, which are also really delicious. And pears, I'm not sure if they're ripe already, but they look good and they're really good when they're ripe. Yeah, so we can make a fruit salad just by stuff from our garden. And that's really awesome. So here I have some of the vegetables that we have. That's tomatoes. We have them in lots of different sizes and they're really delicious. And then paprika or paprika, however you want to pronounce that. And there's some carrots which come in lots of different sizes which are also really good. And that's a broccoli. That's how it looks like. And with all the leaves on. Mm. And uh, a huge zucchini. It's really big. I'm not so much of a zucchini fan, but I think it's really cool that they get this big and they really have a spot. A huge pumpkin. I mean, look at it. It's not even October yet. And it's huge! I nearly can't carry it. And it's not like we we did anything special with the pumpkin to make it big. My mom just placed it somewhere near the near all the hoop from the cows. And uh, it got that big. Where? And that was actually just a selection from what we had. My mom really likes to do gardening and that's we have, why we have a lot of vegetables. So that was um, a little insight into farming, life, vegetable, growing, whatever. I don't know, just random, random stuff with bad hair. That's one of the good things of um, having a family with a small farm. But there's lots more bad things. A little sucker was fighting with another cat. No, no, no. Bye. <laughs> Just bye. Ah. <laughs> so.